Hello, I'm Troy Morlem from NorCal Controls. In this video, I'll be discussing DAS versus SCADA and providing points to help you determine which is best suited for your specific application. The primary difference between DAS and SCADA is that DAS is usually monitoring only, whereas SCADA includes both controls and monitoring capabilities. Some of the main components of both systems are the networking components such as firewall and switches, an internet connection for data transmission off-site and remote access, and meteorological equipment for measuring environmental conditions on the site. A specific component for a DAS is a data logger and or data concentrator which collects the data from the field equipment and transfers it off-site. A SCADA system builds on top of this and adds a power plant controller, SCADA server for the HMI, and a historian server for logging data. A main question that many customers ask is, which system is necessary for my project? The first and main contributing factor of this decision are site capacity and control requirements. A good rule of thumb is that a site capacity of 10 megawatts is the threshold as to when controls are needed to maintain interconnection agreement and power purchase agreement requirements. A SCADA system would be required for sites larger than this threshold. Secondly, cybersecurity requirements would also drive this decision. Stringent requirements set by the North American Electric Reliability Corporation, also known as NERC, can lead a project to need a SCADA system instead of a DAS, depending on its contribution to grid stability. Next, certain project owner requirements and specifications can influence this decision. For example, if there is a requirement for an HMI and historian to be present on a site with one megawatt capacity, a SCADA system would be better suited for this application, even though a DAS would typically be included by default. Lastly, the physical installation space available is an important factor. A SCADA system is housed in a 19-inch networking rack which needs heating and ventilation, whereas a DAS is in a 24 by 24 inch enclosure and can be located outdoors. Thank you for tuning in to this video. For further details on this topic, please visit our website at blog.norcalcontrols.net.